you can drive back there. Can you? Yeah. You can get up there and turn around. It's a big room up there. Loads of room. Let's do a quick, quick little three-point turn here. I'll show you my excellent driving skills. <laughs> you just jump. <laughs> Welcome to Dan O'Brien's Awesome Drive to the Match. I'm Jeff Lemieux. Really excited to be joined today by goalkeeper coach Kevin Hitchcock. Hitchy, how's it going, man? Good. Good, Jeff. Really good. You know, I got to tell you, you're the first coach that we've had on the Awesome Drive. It's been all players to this point, so I got to assume. I'm on it. I got to assume the rest of the coaching staff is back chilling at the training center. Probably super jealous of the situation we got going on right now. I've, I've not even spoke to anybody about it. <laughs> well, when you tell them, they're going to be super jealous, I'm sure. <laughs> well, we're here, obviously, to talk about Georgie Petrovic. Okay. Uh, a lot of people have been talking about Georgie Petrovic over the course of the past few months. Rightfully so. He's kind of burst onto the scene in MLS. But I'm wondering for you, you know, as the guy who works with him closely yep. on a daily basis, you know, as a player who came in as a relative unknown to Major League Soccer, you know, what were your sort of expectations for George through this first half season as he's sort of getting settled into the league? And how has the reality sort of matched up to those expectations? Well, no one ever expected him to do as well as he's done. He's a 22-year-old young boy from Europe. Couldn't speak English. Uh, Goalkeeping-wise, I knew what I was getting. I mean, I saw this... Uh, run of clips of George and, and I said to Remy, Remy, that's the one I want. Let's go and put this to Bruce. Bruce sat down within two seconds, he got up and walked away, yeah, I've seen him. So that was all credit to George. So I knew I had the tools to work with. Uh, like I've said before, the, the biggest loss for this club was losing Matt Turner. But at the moment, it looks like, you know, we've replaced him with another Matt Turner. That's the biggest compliment I could give George. It's unbelievable how uh, it seems like you parted ways with one of the best goalkeepers in the league and potentially brought in one of the best goalkeepers in the league to replace him. And I'm, you know, I'm wondering what you see as a goalkeeper coach. You know, We watch these games and we see this tremendous shot stopping ability, this off the charts shot stopping ability. But what are the little things that maybe we don't see that George A does as a goalkeeper that, that make him an elite shot stopper? Do you want me to give away my secrets? Mm, not all of them, but if you could like give me a hint at like one or two of them. Athleticism. Okay. Plyometrics. Yeah? That's my big go-to. Okay. And I, I work all week on certain things and he's ex excelled at them. And he just, you know, he, everything you put in front of him, he wants to be, he wasn't the cleanest. When he come, he wasn't the cleanest. He loved, loved to parry the ball away. And I'm a big old fashioned, English guy who thinks you should catch every yeah. ball you comes to, whether the balls are coming hard or not. But you know, I, I want him to not be a blocker. I yeah. want him to be a catcher. Okay. And Matt picked that up really, really early in his time with me. So Georgie's trying to master that, and he sometimes he gets caught with, in two minds. But you know, I, I've got nothing but praise to give to George for what he's come in at as a 22 year old who couldn't speak the language. Yeah, I mean, and to that point, at 22, this is obviously a player who's only presumably going to continue to improve, yeah. but only in the short amount of time that you've gotten to work with him. How much stride, how many strides has he made just in that short amount of time? Massive, big strides. It's, it's incredible. And, you know, it's credit to him. He, he, he comes in every day. He works hard. He enjoys working with the other goalkeepers, which is the main thing for me. They all get on really well, which is fantastic and they work hard for each other, and they learn off each other, which is which is great. I mean, I, I look at Earl, especially Brad Knight, and Brad Knight is with him talking to him all the time, and that takes a little bit of pressure off me as well. So, you know, credit to the other guys as well. You mentioned he didn't speak English when he arrived. His English is coming along really well, but has he taught you any Serbian? You picked anything up? Yeah, one word, but I can't repeat it. I figured <laughs> if you had said you didn't learn any Serbian, I would say, I know you know at least a yes. curse word or two. Yes. In Serbian. Well, that's good to know. We'll have a private conversation yeah. afterwards. We can do a little Serbian lesson. Hitchy, really appreciate you taking the time, uh, and best of luck on this uh, this week's trip to New York and Houston. Thanks, Jeff. Thanks very much. This has been Dan O'Brien's awesome drive to the match. Come into any Dan O'Brien Auto Group store today and get your awesome protection plan. Keeping it awesome.